Hey guys, welcome back to this jQuery mobile video and in this video we're going to be going over our config.xml and um, the config.xml is basically a file where you can specify your app such as the name of the app, the, the description, the author, the, um, the icons, the splash screens, the different plugins you use like geolocation, camera, basically to specify different things that you would specify in a native app. Um, so in this video we're going to be doing some basics um, like editing our title and editing our description and changing the author so once we publish the app we can actually receive that name and description get credit for um, the app and all that instead of using the default Hello Cordova title. So let's get started. The first thing we want to do is we want to open up Sublime here. So here under our project folder, we'll click down and you should see these files here. Alright? And in these files you should see this config.xml. If you can open the file, go to your folder go to your folder, Cordova test. And then here you should see this config.xml. So just open that up. Here we have it opened. The first thing we want we want to change is the name of our app. So I'm gonna call the name I'll just call it Cordova Test app for now. And then I'll give it a description of this app was made using Cordova. And I'll give it, give your author name, so I'll give it Sasha Cutlon. I'll put my email here. All right. So now here we can uh, see where our content is. So this specifies uh, where our main page is. So our main page is obviously the index.html, which is located under our www folder. And these are a few of our plugins like Geo, Mail, SMS, Telephone, and our app supports platforms such as Android and iOS. We can add Windows for that, but we'll work on that later. And that's about it for this video. In the future videos, we'll be adding an icon and a splash screen so we can make it more make it a more native app and a more usable app for the user so now what we wanna, what we want to do is like before we want to update our code so click on update code choose file I'm gonna click on Cordova test send to compress zip file wait for this to compress After it compresses, just select it, click open. Once it's there, and once you see the file name, the zip file, click upload. And make sure you have saved this, or else it won't work. And we'll just use the previous, we'll just use what you have the default instead of what you have changed. Wait for this to upload. Now you see here I have my custom name and my custom description. And now we have our, our barcode here and we're waiting on our Android icon to show up. So I'm just going to download this APK just to show you guys how it will look on a mobile screen. I'm just going to click save. I'm going to open up BlueStacks. Click open up BlueStacks. Wait for it to open up. So I can show you guys how it is, how it would be displayed.
starting the engine. All right, once it has finished loading, we want to go over here and click on install APK. Well, first you want to go to my apps and you want to click on um, install APK. Now it should open up your file explorer. All right. And go to the the latest APK, not the previous one that we uh, we worked on earlier. Um, select the one that we just uh, worked on, the one we just edited, the one you gave your own name to. So just select that. So in my case, I called it Cordova Test App. And since this is a debug, not a fully completely signed app, I'm just gonna select this and click Open. You see here, it's gonna install give it a few seconds to install almost done all right so now we have our app here with our default icon and our name here at Cordova test app just click on it and it should start loading up there we go we have our app with all our cool features nice transitions here go home a code of a test app um, so that's basically it for this video Thank you so much for watching. If you had any doubts or if you had some time following through, please ask the questions in the comments and I hope I can answer your questions. Um, thank you.